let's see how to fix any dual boot and related issues so um, check the links for the commands so we're going to run first this sudo apt and get update so open any linux terminal on the linux os that you are running and just paste in the command it will set the base for everything else just update the libraries and stuff then we are going to run the the install software properties common so this is this actually help us to run the repository the pp repos uh, the repository command that we are going to use after it so run this one first then the first one that the ppa repository from the yani ubuntu um because when i was trying to run the the ppa repository on its own it was giving me an, some error so we had to run the software the property commands uh, command first basically that command helps us if any command is not working um that command help us to actually uh, run the let the latter command then we can install the boot repair so sudo apt install boot repair this will install the boot repair program now we can just type in boot hyphen repair this will start the boot repair program that we are going to use to fix any errors it takes some times to load up so now we have the boot repair program we're going to go with the recommended fix it generally fixes all the issues this will try to reinstall the grub um and all the other missing programs So now it will ask you to if you want to upload this to an paste bin which is an online text uploading site so i'm going to hit no and this is going to generate a summary which can be helpful for developers to see what's going on this is the result and uh, basically it's asking us to if you we can with the bios we can set the boot manager and the desired boot manager um in the first order and then followed by the second os that we want so you can do that as well this is a summary let's test it if it has uh, actually worked or not so before while restarting it was always restarting into windows uh, never giving me a choice to choose between so let's see what happens if i click on restart okay it has turned off and we see the grub menu uh, is giving you option to choose between windows and ubuntu I'm going to choose Windows for now. So this is how you fix it. And thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one.